This is Marty Medvitz with Chromeline. Today's quick tip is how to prepare old photo emulsions for disposal. If you have old product or perhaps a bunch of samples that you need to get rid of, depending on local regulations, you may not be able to simply toss these liquids into the trash. Check with your garbage collector to see what guidelines you must follow. However, for my area, paints and similar items must be turned into a solid for proper disposal. I have here a two-year-old gallon of photo emulsion. As you can see, it's still very fluid but it is beyond the manufacturer's shelf life, so it's likely to cause some issues along the screen printing process. From my local hardware store, I purchased this paint hardener. One pack is sufficient to solidify one gallon of emulsion, and it runs about three to four dollars. You could use a power drill with a paddle blade, or even an ink mixing station if you have one. Hand mixing is possible, but can be labor intensive if you have several gallons to harden. I'm going to use the stand mixer to do the hard work for me, as we want to disperse the hardener evenly. It's best to slowly add the hardener so that it disperses more evenly. Dumping the entire pack all at once may lead to only partial hardening. The primary ingredient in paint hardener is sodium polyacrylate, which is a crystallized salt product. Crystals absorb the water in the emulsion, turning latex and acrylic paints into a solid, rubbery substance. Since photoemulsions have similar chemistries to paint, the hardener is effective for our purpose. Just a minute or two of good mixing is sufficient. At this point, the viscosity has increased, but the emulsion is still a fluid. We can see the crystals are well dispersed. Now we let it sit overnight. 24 hours later, the hardener absorbed the excess moisture and successfully turned this gallon into a solid. I can now dispose of it with my regular trash in accordance with local guidelines.